Okay, so Chick-fil-A for a while was sourcing chickens with no antibiotics ever, which is fine. Now they're saying, hey, we're going to source chickens that may have been given antibiotics at some point that are not important in human medicine. What does this mean? So basically, um, if chickens have been given an antibiotic, there's always a withdrawal period before that animal can legally go to market, which means that your meat is antibiotic free. So regardless of what the label says, all meat is antibiotic free full stop. Okay. However, I think that by doing this, they're actually reducing animal suffering. So you shouldn't think that Chick-fil-A is good or bad or whatever based on this policy, um, because it's all antibiotic free anyway. However, um, Antibiotics used in chickens that are not important in human medicine, basically all that's saying is that there are some um, prescriptions and medicines used in humans, some in animals, some in both. Chick-fil-A is basically saying the antibiotics that we use are only going to be used in animals. They have no effect or they're not used in humans, like whatever. But regardless, it doesn't really matter because there's really no antibiotics in meat anyway, so it's all just kind of a moot point. But I mean, I kind of say hats off to Chick-fil-A because I think this will reduce animal suffering. Just like when you're suffering or your family or your pets are suffering, you're gonna wanna give them medicine. So I think overall it's a good move for animal health, but um, don't let it scare you one way or the other that it's bad or good either way. Like it's just, um, it's gonna help treat chickens that might need to be treated. So whatever works.